Hello everyone, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. This one going to show you how to create a stutter effect, a film stutter, or what looks like a film stutter slash hyperlapse effect. Let me show you what I'm talking about. There's regular, there we go, stuttering, film lapse, hyperlapse, that type of thing, and then it goes regular at the end. How did I do it? Let's just do it step by step from the beginning. Okay, good. Let's drag and drop some footage into the timeline. Perfect. I'm going to go in a few seconds and then let's say right about here is where I want the stuttering to start. What am I going to do? I'm going to just hit Command K or Control K if you're on a PC and that just applies a cut or a slice. And then I'm going to move forward to right about here, Command K so that I've basically created a section that I'm going to work on and do the hyperlapse too. So it's going to be regular, hyperlapse, film stutter, and then regular. Okay, good. All right, now I'm going to select this middle piece and I'm going to go to my effects panel my effects panel is right here you don't see it window make sure there's a check mark beside effects good grab posterized time all you gotta do is type in p-o-s-t-e-r and then there's two there's video effects stylized posterized and then there's time posterized time select posterized time it's very important they're two very different effects all right good drag and drop that bad boy on top of it and then presto nothing's happened yet but when we go to the effect controls panel, which is now right here, if you look, you'll see posterized time. And in particular, you're going to see frame rate. We are going to drop this down from 24 frames per second, which is old school film frame rates, to we're going to go way down to like two just to really sell this effect. OK, so we're now creating the stutter. Now, let's just go ahead and hit spacebar. And bang, we have our stutter, okay? That might be all you need to do if you're just looking for a stutter. If you want to give it that hyperlapsed sped up effect, now right click on this section right here and then you get some options. The one you want to go down to is speed duration. I'm going to go ahead and change this to 200% so it's double the speed. And now if I go and hit spacebar, click 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 it's a hyperlapse effect and I know that wasn't perfect but if you want to see it perfect you just want to render it into out just like I'm doing here and then this will then get it out of RAM preview here we go one more time regular click 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 there you go guys that's all there is to it thanks for watching ton more stuff coming up stay tuned